Well, France is slowly being paralyzed by nationwide strikes as French workers try to stop the government from changing some of the socialistic rules on businesses and make the country more economically competitive. Dale Hurd has this report from Paris. French drivers are hunting for gasoline and waiting in long lines to get it because of strikes and blockades at the nation's fuel refineries. The government has had to cut fuel reserves to deal with gasoline shortages caused by strikes and protests over a bill that would trim employment protections. This driver says from last night until 1 o'clock in the morning, I searched with my wife for a gas station and all were empty or closed. This driver says the French people are totally taken hostage. Bernie Sanders supporters need to pay attention to this crisis because the French government is trying to escape from the kind of socialism that Sanders wants to bring to America. Unions are targeting the nation's gas supplies, railroads and electricity network as they try to push the government to drop labor reform devised to make France more globally competitive. French strikes like this one can be violent, with burning barricades, tear gas and street fighting. The French government says it won't back down and has sent riot police to uproot protesters blocking fuel depots and has authorized use of reserves to resupply gas stations that have run dry. France has about three months of fuel reserves left. Dale Hurd, CBN News, Paris.